what's the best way to get clients through social media? Well, today I want to go and show you what Instagram is like and what is the best way to get clients for your social media marketing agency through Instagram. So with that said, let's jump straight onto the laptop and I want to go and take you everything. So we are here on Instagram. Now I'm Italian, so this is why you see everything in Italian. But the procedure is the same for everybody. We go on Instagram via our laptop. We're over here. And I'm just looking at dental care, so dentists and those type of pages, those doctors, and also people that don't really have the best social media out there, but have a lot of money who could like to invest. Out of 100, potentially you'll get a couple that are interested in this. Do not do only this. You can do this with every type of clients out there. So what you want to do, it is very, very straightforward. If you go on follow over here, they're able to go on follow. We can see the, you know, the image here we got posted in October 28, October 24. And since then, it looks like they just stopped. Maybe the person in charge of social media has left the team. So maybe they could also look for somebody on the team. Now, what we want to do? Well, it is very, very straightforward. The first thing we want to look for their information. And once you go and look for their information, whether it's on their post, very likely we got the phone numbers, we got where they are, and also you're able to go and find the email, or if you do not find the email over here, call them at the phone number, say, hey, I would like to propose you something and I would like to write a written email about it, or just kind of follow the links here. We got the contact, we got the, uh, you know, the web page, and on the contacts, we're able to find both the number and the email if you wanna write a proper email. So this is very, very important. We found the email. So we just go and save, let's say all the emails. For example, we can go and copy this email if we want, or we just open a new document. So we write it on the note, we save and make a list of all the emails and we save all of them. Now, the habit of the dentist, what else can we do? Well, from Instagram, it is very simple. You click on follow, and then once you follow them, you will have a lot more popping down here. So we have a new one here, another dentist in the area of Italy, where I'm from. And the same here, we can go and check out. They got September 7. So even older pictures seems like they're not interested in what the social media presence is. But very important, you're also able to go and showcase them that, hey, you have not posted, which is a problem in nowadays. Even for the dentist, they go by word of mouth and so on. But the other thing is, once you go and follow them, you find their email once again, you go on their website over here. Very easy, very simple contact over here. This is all in Italian. And once again, or on the full of foot page, we find the emails where you're able to go and send information. Very important when you go and send the email, make sure that the subject of the emails is something catchy. Don't be like, hey, uh, appointment, and then you're not going to book an appointment. You just want to get their money. You just want to, you know, invite them to the social media marketing agency and so on. So make sure it is an appealing, like get more clients, but not too scammy, if you know what I mean. But from this, if we go over here, and this is what Instagram, it is very simple. Follow them and you have a lot, a lot of dentists. And the same will be if, for example, out of dentists, you look for some uh, chiropractors or some kitchens or some chefs or some restaurants the same once you follow them you will have a list of them you go and find the emails which is more likely you know email and phone number most of them have them on the description of their page of their photos this one don't have it but if you go to his website you're able to find it at the footer of the page super simple and you're also able to offer them as far as you know let's say you know, brand awareness online with posting stories and so on, keeping up to date, you're also able to go and showcase them something else. If you go on their Facebook page, whether you find them on the website or by simple, you know, Facebook search, you look for dentists in your area. Once you are over here, so with Facebook, it is even, it's better in a way because what can you find through Facebook? Well, through Facebook, you're also able, if we go over on about, and you're able to go and see on page transparency over here, you're able to go and see whether or not this page is running advertisements or not. And how do you do this? Well, to go on the about section, page transparency or details, you're also able to see all, this page is not currently running ads. Meaning that in the email that you present to them, in the email that you say, hey, I would like to offer you this, I would like to offer you that, you're also able to say, I noticed that you're not running 
proper ads, you're not running ads at all on social media. And I would like to help you with this to running ads on social media as well as running ads on Google. So find my business. If I Google type dentist in where is this dentist located, we can see it immediately right now. Let's see, this is in Como, in Italy, in Lake Como, you know where that is. Well, we're able to go and text, you know, text him or send him an email saying, you know, we know, we saw you're not running currently ads in the area of Como, neither in any area, area in the world, in Italy. And I would like to help you with it as well as Google search. We would like to go and showcase you what the power of Google is. Now, once you start a advertisement or once you start to get a client like this, What's very important, and I will take you the results as well for my personal subject and my personal idea on this, is to either give them a week or two weeks trial to then go and do half a month paid, or give them a month of trial, or just don't do anything and just start with the work. But of course, if you do offer them with trials, if you do offer them with some free material, they'll be more likely to be like, okay, let's try it, let's start it, and if you're good enough and you can, you know, you have also the luck because you need that. To go and find them new clients that say, hey, I came here through Facebook, I came here through Google, I found you like this, I found you like that, they will most likely be happy to go and spend money on you. We being dentists, doctors, they're also able to go and spend more money than other you know, people and other activities within the area or within the social media. So this is a very simple way. So the most effective way to go and find clients or to have an email list for so to say to find clients build up your email list is through Instagram, very simple, and you got this one as well. And then you go and follow them, you go on Facebook, or if you do not find the website, they don't have the website, don't worry, look for them on Facebook, because if they have Instagram, they have also Facebook, and over here, you're able to find the email. So this is going to be Sabrina Giuliano 91 it is going to be the email that they got. This one look more active over on their Instagram and on their Facebook, as we're able to go and see here. They got video, they showcase their audience, they showcase result, patience, and so on. So this is very interesting, but you're also able, you're very able to find the email either on their Instagram or either on their Facebook. And the same, if we're going to look for another page over here, this one, yes, they, they have a website, but if you go and look for them on Facebook, let's say that you got the website over here, they potentially have the Facebook, uh, you know, add on, click on, whatever it is, that over here. So this is Giuseppe, this is the doctor, the doctor and the other doctor. So what you're able to also go and find over here, either you go on Facebook, you write them privately or you write them, you know, anyone can write them privately. And the page also has the email and the phone number over here. So they got two different, you know, uh, housing for what the dentist is working at and you have the possibility to have two clients or one not for the price of two but for the price of one and a half because it's the same client so this is also very important and over here but you do not see it because it's covered by this we are able to go and find facebook so facebook and instagram over here we can go and click on the facebook logo you need to look for it if you do not want to call them you can have the email over here this email was not on the website you need to fill this up but the email was not here. So how to find the email? Go on Facebook. Facebook will give you the email that they use to sign up as they are a business and you're able to go and send them a direct email without calling them. So it is very, very simple. It is very, very straightforward. As you're able to see, Instagram and Facebook are two of the best, easiest and simplest way to go and find an email list to go and build your emailing list. Now you can send them one by one or you can just do one day of research and one day of hammering down with the email the next day. So do some research between Instagram and Facebook. You're only, you know, you're going to be able to reach uh, X amount of email due to the time you have, the responsibilities that you got, the things you got to do. If you got all the time in the world, you can reach up to 200 emails a day, 300 emails a day. It's up to you how many hours you're able to stay in front of the laptop. And why do I say the laptop? Well, it is because it's easier to go and find all of this, save on an email list, everything that comes from the laptop instead of something that comes from the phone. And then you need to swipe, you need to find the app, you need to write the notes. So do it on the laptop. If you have it, it's super, super easy and you will not go and forget about it. You save it on the desktop and you got all the emailing lists like that. As a dentist, chiropractors, schools, you can do this with anything, restaurant, bar, and so on. So 
If this helped you, leave a like, subscribe, let me know down in the comments, and I will see you all in the next video. Take care, and ciao, guys.